The Montana's and Molotow, the difference between the different types of paint is honestly feel. Molotow, it has more of a, if you're, if you're more of a graffiti writer and you like painting fast, you like the paint shooting out more, not so controllable, but if you like the feel of working quickly, Molotow is a great brand to go with. It's, it's a feel thing. It really is a feel. I can't stress that more because like there's no right or wrong tool you, you choose to use. If you, if you use brushes, it's up to you which type of brush you like to use. You know what I mean? If you like a chisel tip, if you like a round tip, it, that's up to your choice as an artist. It's the same idea with spray paint. Personally, I like to go with 94s. I also like to go with Molotow as well, but it does depend on the job. It depends on what I'm asked to do. It depends on what I'm planning on doing. If I'm going to do a portrait, I'm probably not going to go with the Molotow just because I know that that paint comes out faster. It's a little more quicker. I have to work faster with it. Whereas opposed, if I went with a 94 low pressure can, I could take my time on it, make sure my details are really accurate and I can do everything I want to do with it. But it really is a feel thing. So that, as opposed to the Rust-Oleum or the Krylon brands, these are going to be a lot faster, filling in large areas, not the best to do detailed stuff with. You know what I mean? It really, you just got to pick the right tool for the right job of what you're doing as an artist to produce the, the image that you're trying to produce. You know what I mean?